Zoho Motivator is a sales performance management tool that brings together analytics and gamification to help Zoho CRM users boost sales team engagement and performance while having more fun. It provides real-time analysis of your company's performance and helps you create an exciting, competitive environment to motivate your team to perform its best. In this video, I'd like to introduce you to the basics of Motivator, including its key features and how to get started. Motivator runs as a layer on top of CRM, so all the users and data you see in Motivator come from CRM. Motivator allows you to track and analyze your company's performance using KPIs or key performance indicators and set targets and contests based on those KPIs. KPIs are business metrics that help you define and measure progress in achieving your organizational goals. You can track your organization's key sales metrics and evaluate the performance of your team using KPIs and Motivator. The first thing you see when you log in to Motivator is the Home Dashboard. You can always come back to this Home Dashboard by clicking the logo on the top left corner. The Home Dashboard provides an overview of your KPIs, targets, and contests. One of the first things you'll want to do is set up and configure the KPIs that are important to your sales process. To add a new KPI, click Plus KPI and New KPI at the top of the dashboard. Select the formula you'd like to use for your KPI. Click Add Behavior to define the CRM activities for this KPI, which could be based on any modules in CRM. Configure the details of behaviors, such as how you want your points to be calculated, based on what type of records, and who will be receiving the points. After defining the details, click Save Behavior, add a name and description, and a new tile will appear on your dashboard. Click and drag the tiles to change the order as you wish. KPIs in green means that the numbers have trended upward in comparison to the previous period. KPIs in red have trended downward. All of the information is based on the data in CRM. You can click on any KPI for a more detailed view. Trend charts shows the value of the KPI over time. Breakdown charts let you compare performance across teams and individuals. Once you've set up the KPIs you want to track, the next step is to set targets to keep your team focused on those key sales activities that you know will lead to more sales. To add a new target, click Plus Target and New Target at the top of the dashboard. Select the KPI to set the target. Pick the target period from the available options and enter the target values for your company, teams, and or individuals. Personal target is for only for you to see. Once you're satisfied, click Next and review the targets before saving them. Now, Motivator creates personalized scorecards for everyone based on the targets you set for the company, teams, and individuals. You can check out your scorecards by clicking Targets and Scorecards. In the scorecard, a small white line indicates today's goal, showing where you should be today. The scorecard is green if the current value is greater than or equal to today's goal, white if less than 25% off, yellow if less than 50% off, and red if more than 50% off of today's goal. When you are not on pace to reach your goal, your scorecard will also indicate what needs to be done to get back on pace. Once you've set up KPIs and targets, you can easily create a contest to further energize your team and boost performance. From the Home dashboard, select a KPI or target for which you'd like to create a contest. Click the Action menu at the top right and select Create Contest. Default values are set to allow you to start the contest with one click, but you can easily configure the contest to suit your needs. You can click the values you want to change in the review screen or make a selection in the top left. Once you're done, click Save. Contest leaderboard is now added to the dashboard. Click on the tile to see the details. 
This is a great way to view a contest on your computer, but to boost visibility and increase competition, you can use the TV channel's interface to show information on large screen TVs in your office. To configure the settings for the TV channel, click TV channels at the navigation bar on top and select the channel which you want to configure. Click Manage link to show the settings page. At Channel Display Settings, you can choose how to display the information between Slide View and Grid View. By selecting Slide View, you can see the information of each tile as slides with animation. By selecting Grid View, you can see all the tiles in 4x4 grid as shown in the dashboard. Another great way to view the company performance on large screen TVs is by using the Live Dashboard. It visually shows the components of the selected tiles such as KPIs, targets, and contests in real time. To configure it, just click Live Dashboards at the navigation bar on top and click plus to add a new Live Dashboard. Select any component to configure the type of tiles and their options. When ready, click Full Screen. You can also generate a URL to share it with your colleagues. Motivator TV and Live Dashboard provide a visually engaging overview of your team's activities, boosting motivation by increasing visibility and recognition for performance. Finally, let's cover some key settings. Click on the top right menu and select Settings to open Settings. Toggle between Yes and No to activate and deactivate users and motivator. Users must be active to manage or participate in KPIs, targets, or contests. Motivator automatically syncs data from CRM in the background, including custom modules and fields. However, if you make new changes to modules or fields, select CRM Sync from the top left menu and click Resync Users, Modules, Fields to inform Motivator of the changes. I hope you enjoyed this introduction to Zoho Motivator. Visit Zoho's website to learn more about Zoho Motivator and to try it out for free.